Hello and welcome to a new video on the Road to Glory. Uh, in this video we're going to have a look at this fantastic new card that I, I, I think this is. Uh, the new milestone card that just came out, uh, Politano. Uh, to get this we have to grind um, all 20 teams from uh, Serie A. Uh, it took me uh, quite a few hours to grind this card, uh, but I was very excited to get it and test it out and give you my thoughts on it, uh, if he's actually as good as it looks. So this is the card, um, as you see the face stats, 91 pace, 85 shooting, 84 uh, passing, 88 dribbling, uh, 46 defending, 65 physical. Um, he's uh, a high medium with uh, left foot, 4 star, 4 star. Uh, he's 171 uh, in centimeters, so that will make him like 5'6", so he's uh, quite short, but uh, that uh, kind of goes with his stats. As you can see here, his pace very nice, 92, 91, uh, sprint speed. His shooting is all in the mid 80s, only with long shots at, at 90, and passing also in the mid 80s. Um, dribbling, very high agility at 94, uh, nice balance 91, good ball control, good dribbling, good composure, and very high stamina at 91. So this is going to be a machine uh, from start to finish. If you put him in the team, as he's going to be running up and down. He's small, so with his high agility and balance, uh, I want to think that he's going to feel like a Messi, uh, turning him around. Um, so what we need in this card is to improve his shooting and his passing. He doesn't need any pace. His dribbling is fine. Um, so we're going to give him a dead eye uh, to bump those shooting and passing stats, especially the shooting stats in the 90s. And this is going to make a fantastic card, I think. I'm going to go into a two champs games actually uh, to test them out uh, right away so I'm gonna try him in the 4-2-3-1 as a central can and then I'm gonna try him in the 4-1-2-1-2 as a striker uh, with another partner of pump to see which of the two positions uh, might fit him uh, well so let's jump into a game and see how he does all right so here's the team um, Quite a strong team, good attack, Ben Yenner, Dembele, Martial, uh, we'll see uh, how we do with this uh, new card, I'm very excited to try out. So first I will try the 4-2-3-1, so Politano will play in the central camp position. There we go, great small movement. Um, be nice to maybe serve one with the other stats are fantastic. Let's see if we can put the ball in for a corner. Oh yes he can. Oh yes he can. What a ball. Let's get a little spooky celebration. What a fantastic uh, corner. Obviously, you want him to take the corner since he's very short, like you said, uh, five, five foot six. So, look at this ball coming in straight to Langlet. That does a 360 pirouette and puts it in. But, uh, anyways, uh, first uh, assist with Politano. Very nice. Yeah. There you go. Oh, yeah. There you go. Yes. Oh no. I didn't get back into this game. Yes. Put that in now. No! It's alright. Uh, there was a couple occasions where I thought he wasn't that great. As you can see, he has the highest rated score after Langlet, who scored the goal so far. But there were probably instances where it was my fault and not the actual player reacting. So let's get into the second half and see. Oh. Very fast in uh, executing the dribble. So 
good with that. You can see here, very good. I have to get a little bit in, maybe cut the ball. Um, but I like to try shooting. All right, let's put him again on the corner. Look at that curve, 90, power 96, free kick accuracy 87. All right, we do the run near course, uh, post uh, corner tactic, as you can see here. Then we whip it in somewhere in the middle. Get that header in. Uh, very good first game uh, for Pontano. I really liked him. As a central cam, uh, he plays good. I don't know, I didn't actually see the formation the opponent was playing in. Uh, he didn't have much space, but um, he's very quick to turn, very good on the dribble. Um, his shots weren't that good, although I think there were weird angles that I, I took him, so I can't really judge him on that. In general, I really liked him. Um, so now I think I'm going to try him as a striker up top, so maybe he'll have space for some third balls and see if he can run and finish some uh, shots and get some goals in. So we'll try him in the 4 one 2 one 2 formation and with uh, Insigne up top or maybe with Aubameyang and Insigne as a camp. So let's get into the second game and see how he does there. All right, second game. Uh, typical Bundesliga slash uh, La Liga hybrid. All the meta players are here. So this is gonna be a tough opponent. Um, don't know what he plays. So I'm gonna guess that 4 3 3 4 maybe. All these players. We're gonna go into the 4 1 2 1 2 left, as I said. And uh, get to try this Politano card on the striker. Alright, so that was a stupid mistake. Just start off the game. Insignia with a quick equalizer. Oh no, 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 that was a bad touch. I don't know why he kind of stopped there for some reason. What? No foul. Alright. So I managed to keep the ball up there, but I that's not a foul. So as you can see here, he's not playing very well up there. So what I'm going to do is switch him back to the central camp position. Uh, put Mane up top with Insigne and see if that works out better. Yes, there we go. 2-2. Two -two. Good quick passing. Alright, so that was the second game. Uh, we lost, as you can see, typical, uh, oops, typical uh, game, especially in champs. You get 10 shots, gets 5. Uh, you get all the possession, you get all the tackles, you get the fouls. Um, just don't have the accuracy because the, all the bodies are falling in front of these shots. But we're not here for that, we're here for Politano. Um, so I played him up top. As a second striker, uh, not really that good. Uh, I switched him in the, the halftime as a central cam. Played a little bit better. Uh, well, actually played a lot better than as a striker, as a central cam. And then at the last uh, 15 in-game minutes, I think I put him as a right CM. Uh, so I can put in uh, Aubameyang at top and Insigne as a cam. So he also played well as a, as a CM. But I think he's well suited for a central cam and maybe a wide uh, a wide cam as well. I uh, might have uh, another go at him uh, later on and uh, or tomorrow in D four two three one and play him as a wide cam and see if he's there as well. So all in all, uh, I think it's a fantastic card, especially 
card that you get for free and especially a card that has the potential of it probably might get an, uh, an upgrade as indicated by the, uh, the writing uh, that they had in the milestone so potentially he's going to be getting an upgrade as in the storyline uh, in the, the future uh, but I don't know how how high this card can go I mean as you can see with uh, the dead eye his acceleration is uh, 92 and sprint speed 91 he gets a 98 attack positioning 98 finishing uh, 96 shot power 95 long shots um, he gets 92 vision uh, 91 crossing uh, 95 short, short pass and 90 curve his agility is to the roof I mean his stamina is fantastic I mean if this card gets an update upgrade uh, it's probably gonna be the best card in the game anyways this is a fantastic card uh, I think it's worth the grind it's quite easy to do it as you don't need the win you just need the players the way I did it was um, uh, I actually had the front six uh, as uh, Serie A players uh, and I had three other Serie A players as substitutes um, I would go into the 4-1-2-1-2 uh, so I can have three players uh, close to having a chance on goal the two strikers in the camp as soon as I would score a goal I would substitute it for a player of another team that I need a goal and I will try to work that around Politano, fantastic card. I give it two thumbs up, uh, two hands up, two legs down, uh, hat, uh, uh, beer, or whatever you want it. Uh, it's a great, great, great card. I really like it, and especially for free. Uh, go and get it. Uh, it's going to be a great addition to, uh, into your team. So leave a like if you enjoyed this video, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.